He was a badass Mandalorian commando, and I'm building his armor. I'm going to tell you all about it today on Darth Rage Reviews. <laughs> Your source for the Force? Nah, for the Republic! Greetings, Force fans, and welcome to another episode of Darth Rage Reviews, your source for the Force. So it is build time again. This is a commission build. Uh, this is going to be for my good friend Cody, who is the head of the Delta Squad uh, down in Mobile, Alabama, uh, the 501st Legion Alabama Garrison. Uh, so he has a Mandalorian that he wants me to work on for him. And y'all know how much I love doing armor. Y'all know how much I love doing brand new armor that I haven't done before. And the only Mando I've done is the Mando is Din Djarin. So, uh, I'm looking, really looking forward to this. So the, the Mandalorian that he is doing is a guy named Cal Scarada and me being the endless wealth of Star Wars knowledge that I am, I of course had no idea who that was. So I had to look him up. Um, Cal Scarada, let me tell you, he was a badass. This dude was a Mandalorian commando. He was friends with Jango Fett and Jango basically recruited him to help train and prepare the clone army. Um, and the dude like super cool. Uh, actually, if you see him, he looks a lot like Ed Harris. I mean, dude is like Ed Harris Mandalorian, basically. Uh, if they ever did him cinematically, it should be Ed Harris. I mean, that home homeboy is Ed Harris as a Mandalorian. Um, but yeah, d dude was really cool. Uh, took an attachment to uh, the clones that they referred to as Null. They called them Null. Uh, the Camonians, Camonians, Cam Camu. I don't even know how you pronounce that. Uh, on Camino, uh, when the clones uh, did not, you know, if they started to show defects, if you will, uh, the uh, Camonian, Camonian, whatever, they they would basically kill them. Uh, and he didn't like that. And he kind of took them under his wing and he would train them. And anyway, cool story. Look it up. Uh, if you don't know who Cal Scarada is, look it up. It's really cool. So his armor basically is Django's armor. Um, and I'll put up a shot of the CRL here so you can kind of see what it looks like. So it's Django's armor style. Um, I, that God, it's maybe, I don't know if it's a Django helmet. Uh, Django's armor style, but in more of a kind of sand gold color. Um, so yeah, super psyched about this. Uh, he's given me all the pieces, parts, you know, I got the helmet here, obviously, uh, little pieces like, and this is all an ABS plastic kit. I apologize. I'm not sure where he got it from. I will reach out to him, find out where this kit is from and I'll put it in the description, but back plate. Uh, there's also a backpack that goes with it, but you do do not need it for the CRL, so uh, he has chosen not to do that. Uh, we may go a different route and do it in the future, but yeah, that back plate, cod piece, you know, various, various parts, pieces, shoulder bells, nice little tiny shoulder bells. I love that. It's going to be easy. Uh, the chest piece, and I've only got three quarters of it here, but it's, it's that boba style, three, three piece, four piece. I guess it's it's also Django style. So it'll be a little center diamond, another piece here. Uh, he's given me the flight suit as well, uh, the boots. I love this. So for those of you that don't know, in the Star Wars universe, many of the boots are Chelsea's. So this is a pair. I think these are Skechers. What are these? Are these Skechers? No, nope, these are Doc Martens. So straight up Doc Martin Chelsea's. That's the base for the shoe. That is the base for Din Djarin shoe. It's a base for a lot of different Star Wars shoes. And then you'll basically come over top with an armor piece here that will snap onto the sides. Oop. And the top of the boot there. So that and that turn a standard Chelsea boot into Mandalorian. Pretty cool. That's what I, you know, one of the things I love about Star Wars is how they'll take real world items and incorporate those and in, into uh, the designs of their costumes. And it just really grounds it in a realism that you wouldn't get if you, you know, weren't using real world items. It's just super cool. Super cool. Uh, again, I'm going to find out who he got this piece from. Sorry. 
who we got this piece from. It's somebody down in Florida. Uh, and again, I'll link that in the description, but this is the belt and holster. And this thing is nice, real leather. Here. Pleather doesn't make that sound. Squeaky leather. Uh, he's also got the West Star. Very Django. Very, very Django. I've always enjoyed a West Star. Cool gun. Uh, but that all ready to go. Gave me the jumpsuit as well. It's a one piece jumpsuit like Django and Boba. Um, and he's also got this leather, I forget what they call this. It's basically a vest. And this is where I'll mount all the chest armor and that stuff too. So, yeah. Another build is on the way. And of course, like the last ones and all my commission builds, uh, I'll be documenting this with lives uh, as we go along. Um, I've already done one live as I kind of smoothed out different pieces, parts of the helmet. So yeah, you had to, the CRL calls for these to be hollowed out with black mesh behind them. So I had to go ahead and do that. But yeah, cool, cool concept, cool armor. And I am really looking forward to uh, sharing this build with you and getting this build done for Cody. So follow along with me, please, as we do it. I'll be doing lives the whole way just to document the process. Um, right now, I'm currently in the stages of trying to figure out where to get the paint from. So uh, I looked on, you know, the Home Depot and Lowe's online and possible matches. I'm going to have to go in store and look. If I can't find it there, uh, I can always find it in Montana. And uh, I have kind of figured out some of the colors in Montana if I need to. So it's basically going to be a red, a brown, and then primarily that sand gold that I'm looking for. A little black as well. So follow along as I do this live, y'all. It's a fun process. I enjoy doing it. I enjoy sharing it with you. Uh, and I enjoy making this armor. So it's a brand new build. We're working on Cal Scarada. It's a commission build for one of my boys in the 501st. Cody, it's coming your way. So if you enjoyed this video, y'all, please give me a like. I do appreciate it. Comment builds the engagement it helps youtube know that people like this and it will help spread this stuff to the masses and and that helps me ultimately you want to help me i want to help me anyway if you enjoyed it give me a like give me a subscribe do all that fun stuff as always y'all i'm darth rage this is darth rage reviews your source for the force the circle is now complete when i left you i was but the learner now i am the master